Alright, GTA 5 is a psychotic game of criminal activity and sweet, sweet revenge. That's what makes it so fucking awesome. If you kill me in free mode, that's totally fine. That's the whole point of the game. I'm not gonna bitch about it. I don't understand the people that do. That's the whole point of this game. If you don't want to get killed, then you should be playing fucking My Little Pony or something. But if you kill me, be warned. I will hunt your ass down. I will kill you and get my revenge. But if I'm about to kill you and you go into passive mode, I've got two words for you, buddy. Fuck you. I mean, what the hell? Fight like a man. Don't pussy out. Not only is going into passive mode a dick move, it is also a bitch move. I mean seriously man, if you're not ready to get your ass whooped, don't go whooping other people's asses, it's basic math. You killed me, prepare yourself for a battle, don't be a little bitch. Now if anyone from Rockstar is watching this, I have a solution for this little bitch problem. If you kill someone in free mode, you should not be able to go into passive mode for at least 2 minutes. That way the victim still has enough time to get their revenge. Simple right? Now this isn't the greatest solution, but it should work. The user will only have two options after killing someone at this point. Their first option is to wait the two minutes and accept the fact that their butthole is about to get wrecked. Their second option is to switch lobbies and give in to the doom of the never ending loading screen. Thanks for watching, and hopefully someone from Rockstar was watching this too so they can please solve this bitch problem because I cannot take it anymore. Thanks for watching, and yeah, I'll see you guys next week. Bye.